At the Zhuhai Air Show 2024, the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy plan unveiled its new Jabe 15D electronic warfare fighter jet, marking its first public appearance. Developed by Shenyang Aircraft Corporation, the Jabe 15D is designed to enhance China's carrier based electronic warfare capabilities. It joins the newly introduced Jabe 15T multirole fighter as part of plan's expanding fleet. According to the Chinese Ministry of National Defense, the Jabe 15D is tailored for electronic warfare operations, similar to the U.S. Navy's EA 18G Growler, known for its standoff, escort, and self protection jamming capabilities. Images from the airshow showed the Jabe 15D equipped with two underwing EW pods and two additional pods on ventral hardpoints, suggesting it can perform high, mid, and low band jamming. These systems are distinct from those on China's Jabe 16D EW aircraft with the Jabe 15D also featuring wingtip tactical jamming receiver pods, a feature not found on the Jabe 16D. In training exercises on November 9, 2024, the Jabe 15D flew in formation with the Jabe 15T and conducted maneuvers with the Z-20J shipborne helicopter and the Z-8C transport helicopter, including reverse area landings and buddy refueling operations. The Jabe 15D is based on the Jabe 15S twin-seat model, but has been modified for electronic warfare. Key changes include the removal of the OLS-27 infrared search and tracking device, the 30mm cannon, and the PTO tube, along with the replacement of the radar with an active electronically scanned array, ASA radar. The aircraft first flew in April 2021, and its public debut suggests potential operational deployment soon. The initial deliveries of the Jabe 15 d are believed to have begun as early as 2019 for trial purposes. The Jabe 15 ds design is suited for integration into China's Katabar Fujian aircraft carrier, which is currently undergoing sea trials. It may even be capable of carrying anti-radiation missiles for enemy air defense suppression. As part of the plan's efforts to modernize its naval aviation, the Jabe 15 d will likely operate alongside the Jabe 15 t in theater-wide operations, contributing to the growing capabilities of China's carrier air wing. Alongside the Jabe 15 d China operates several other electronic warfare aircraft. The Jave 16D, an EW variant of the Jade 16 fighter, has been used in training alongside the Jade 20 stealth fighter, while the Y9LG, a long range EW platform, recently participated in joint exercises with Thailand. These aircraft demonstrate China's growing expertise in electronic warfare and its strategic vision for expanding naval air power. The Jave 15DS introduction, along with the Jade 15T, represents a significant expansion of China's carrier air wing, signaling a new era of electronic warfare capabilities. With the upcoming addition of new platforms like the J-35 Stealth Fighter and KJ-600 Airborne Early Warning Aircraft, the plan is preparing for a future where advanced electronic warfare, combat, and surveillance systems are fully integrated into its carrier strike groups. The j 15 d is not just a step forward in naval aviation, it marks China's continued rise as a global maritime power. Thank you.